All right, so we just pulled up here to Target. Let's check out what they have for a restock this week. We'll start over here in the basketball section. We got some Phoenix basketball for the first time in my area. I noticed they're charging $65 a box, which is actually pretty criminal for this product, even though it is pretty fun to rip open. But $70 after tax, definitely gonna hardcore pass there. Then they have for the first time at Target, we have 2024 Tops Update Baseball. They have blaster boxes, then they have a few value packs remaining up here. $7 value pack, $25 for the blasters. Pretty good prices. Probably gonna end up grabbing a few of those just to rip open off camera. Then here's a good look at everything else. All around, pretty good restock over here at Target. All right, so we just pulled up here to Walmart now. Let's check what they have for a restock this week. I'm not even sure if they did restock. I'm not really seeing anything new. It's mostly just leftovers from last week. Well, I'll start over here. They got Donruss Elite Football Blasters. I'm pretty sure these are from last week. I think these are new. We have some discounted basketball. 2021 uh, Mosaic at $15 and Flux at $15. We need more blaster boxes at $15 and $20. So that's really nice to see. Here's a good look at everything else. I think I think these are new. Some Donruss Elite Football Value Packs at $7.99, which is a nice site. There's no Tops Update. There's no Select Football. So hopefully we start to see some different formats of those products in the next couple weeks. But all around, it always is a blessing just to make our way out here in the wild. So we just pulled up here to Meyer and check out what they have for a restock this week. Get a good look at the shelves. This is looking like one of the best restocks Meyer has had in a very long time. We'll start over here. We got probably close to 15 or 20 select football mega boxes, which is a really nice site over here at Meyer. We'll slide down a slot. We got some mystery, mega mystery football power boxes and basketball. Looks like for both boxes, they're charging $50 a box. And they advertise some pretty decent stuff. It says, look for rookie graded cards on both of them. And each box says you get one graded card, which is pretty cool as well. And here's a good look at everything else. As you guys can see, there is a ton of stuff to choose from. They got more select football value packs. We have Donruss Elite value packs as well. And there's tons of other really nice looking stuff as well. So like I said, this is the best restock that Meyer has had in months. I'm going to end up walking out of here. I'll probably grab maybe a few of these just to rip open on the channel and test out. I'm going to pass on the select football mega boxes at $60. But all around, this is one of the best restocks Meyer has had in a very long time all right as you guys were able to see from the card hunting side of the video we found a ton of really nice products out in the wild it was one of the better restock weeks we've had in months in this video we're going to be opening up a tops update baseball blaster we also have a select football mega box but before we get into the rip i'm going to be running a free youtube giveaway where all you guys have to do to get qualified to win any of the prizes i'm about to show you is just like this video comment on this video then of course be a subscriber so this giveaway is going to end november 27th Second, like I said, there's going to be five giveaway prizes. I'll show you those right now. Giving away a Costco exclusive Donruss football bundle. It's absolutely ginormous. Takes up the entire screen. I got a mega mystery football power box. Everyone's favorite mystery boxes. There's also a select football target exclusive mega box. A Topps composite football mega box. And last but not least, we have a Victor Wembenyama Optic 10. So there's going to be five different prizes. And again, all you have to do to get qualified to win anything I just showed you is just like this video, comment on this video, and of course, be a subscriber. Appreciate everyone that's helped make all the success on the channel. You know, without you guys, this channel wouldn't be anything. So I got to give back and show love to you guys. That's just how I roll. Without any further ado, hopefully we can get lucky and pull something cool. That's obviously always the goal. I opened up a few um, update blasters off camera. Pulled that awesome looking Aaron Judge Paw Patrol card. Wish I would have got that one on video, but can't win them all. Hopefully we pull something cool though. Everyone say a prayer to the card gods. Let's get active for the one time. With select, we're just hoping for a numbered card. These mega boxes are pretty much glorified blaster boxes. 
Like you, you're really just looking for like a numbered card. There's no, there's nothing to really justify the price increase in my opinion. We got a first die cut Deontay Banks, silver Lamar Jackson, and a rookie of Anthony Richardson with Tommy DeVito. Like if, if these mega boxes, cause they're like 65, 70 bucks. If they guaranteed a numbered card, I would understand, but they're, they're just like blasters. There's nothing guaranteed. All you get is just the 10 exclusive die cuts. And, you know, oh, we got Panini points. Hopefully it's a decent amount. We got DeAndre Swift, Cooper Cup. It's just going to be 250 Panini points. That is a super random, super random. First one to get it wins. Super random. Obviously, we would have rather had the autograph there. But moving along, we're looking at Deshaun Watson, Warren. We got Puka on the rookie. It's good to have Puka back. Travis Kelsey, Michael Thomas on the die cut, Will Levis, and Drew Sanders. Halfway through. It says you can pull zebras in these boxes. I have not seen anyone pull one yet. And I, I highly doubt we're going to even get a numbered card considering that we pulled the points. I swear, I pull a Zay Flowers die cut in every mega box I've opened so far. We'll sleeve that for now. We also got Jalen Carter, another Puka rookie, and Jalen Jones. Two packs left. Throw us a doggy bone. We need a rookie, or um, we need just a numbered card. Something, something to cheer us up. Got Will Levis. There we go. We got a white die cut back there. I think those are out of 99, maybe. Garrett Wilson, Jordan Addison. Hopefully we get a rookie. Deuce Vaughn. And then it is a rookie. I can see that much. Looks like a blue team Colts. Oh, it is Colts. Wow. Man, if that would have been Anthony Richardson, that would have been a big card. 161 of 199, Jalen Jones. Nice color match. Awesome looking card. But not really who we're looking for. All around, it's been a pretty good box for uh, select mega box standards. We also had King Henry and Jackson Smith. Last pack of this box. Highly doubt we get anything special in this pack because we've already got two hits. We got Kobe Turner, Tajay Spears, Cooper Cup, Cooper, Zeke, Tank Dell, and Brenton Strange. All around, you know, it wasn't a great box, but it's that's like as good as it gets with those. Wish the players would have been better, but all around, like I said, we're happy to pull hits. We're happy to get, I mean, I'm not really a big fan of Panini points, but I've been able to get some really cool stuff with them. You can, for those that don't know, um, you can redeem those points on Panini's website. And sometimes they drop cards on there that you can use your points to redeem for actual cards. In the past, I've gotten, I've only redeemed three cards. But in the past, I've gotten a Jamar Chase Rookie Auto Gold Mosaic. I've got a Gold Prism Auto of a, a Devonta Chain and a Tyree Kill Contenders Auto. So you can get nice stuff. Let's move on to Tops update. We're looking for we're looking for this guy right here. We're looking for Paul Skeens as well, and we're looking for the super short prints and possibly the you know Aaron Judge Paw Patrol cards that are hilarious. Autographs are always fun as well. So these backwards cards are going to be the Halloween exclusive parallels. You get it says on the box you get two of them, but so far I've been getting like four box. We got Austin Martin, Rizzo, and Zach Wheeler. So far, nothing super crazy. But all it takes is one pack, one card to change your whole attitude around. And that's what we're looking for here. Lots of rookies. We got a backwards card for the Dodgers. Let me get Otani. Dang. We got Tyler Glasnow and Corbin Carroll. And then probably my favorite rookie in the class, we got Jackson Churio. All right, Freddie Furman. Every time I see this guy, I think it's Freddie Freeman. All right, let's see what we got. 
So far, our best pull is the Ellie base. I'll go and dig out all of our rookie pulls from that stack after the video. Juan Soto in the Nationals uniform. It's random. Three packs to go. We're looking for a numbered card. We're looking for a short print. Something cool. Something to celebrate. Pete Crow Armstrong. Another and Jackson Trio. Two of my top dogs. Shota. And just that's it for that pack. I mean, at least we got th um, three good rookies there. All right, we got Austin Martin this time. Cade Cavalli and Bellinger. Probably been one of the worst box I've opened of this product, but it only takes one card to change your entire attitude around. Hopefully it's waiting in this pack for us. We need something. Two backwards cards. One of them's numbered out of 999. We've got Tyler Black. We're just going to flip it. Three, two, one. We've got Robert Garcia on the blue shimmer. So we ended up with a numbered card. Did not really go the way we wanted. But all around, can't really be too upset. It's always a blessing just to rip some packs open. Here's a recap of everything we were able to pull from. We got about $100 worth of boxes there. We got the Blue Shimmer, Jackson Churio, Shota, P. Crow Armstrong, Churio again. We got one Ellie De La Cruz, a handful of die cuts. Jordan Addison was a nice one. Levis, Puka, Zay Flowers. We did get a nice Puka base. 250 Panini points. Richardson on the base rookie and one numbered card of out of football, out of 199, the white die cut of Jalen Jones. So all around, not the funnest trip in the world, but like I said, it's always a blessing to strip some packs open. And that's going to do it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to get qualified for the free YouTube giveaway. And if you enjoyed this video, show some love as always and peace out.